Welcome friends. I received Lambretta pots. Let us unpack it and let us see what are all the pots inside. These are the stand boots, center stand boots, left and right. This is air filter. There is a little bend here during transportation. There is no problem, we can correct it. And inside of this, some parts are there. This is contact set point and this one also. There are two contact set points. And this is flywheel cover. These are to avoid ingress of dust to the coils. This is contact set point. And this is also same. This hole is for securing this contact set point to the stator plate. Actually this is, we can call it as a simple switch. It is making the contact and breaking the contact. It is now, it is making contact. When it comes here, it is breaking the contact. Actually there will not be this much distance. The distance will be very, very less, very less. So actually there are some disadvantages with this contact set point. This material is ebonoid. Along with these parts, I have some my collection of Lambretta parts. Those are, this is front hub. This is APA. I managed it locally from an old person who is the Lambretta lover and enthusiast. In those days he purchased that, he kept it safe, so till I purchased from him. Some other parts are, these are the speedometer glasses. I gave measurement to glass shop, glass cutting shop and I made it, these are very good ones. And this is spark plug. And these are the caps. On the pressure plant. Stand spring. And these are the APA monograms. These all are my collection. These are purchased in the year of 1992. Still, I kept it, I kept them safe. Only I think three are with me and one more must be there. Yes. Okay, this is contact set point. There is a difference between the point which I have shown earlier and this. We will see that. And this is the gear pulley. And this is the brass one. This is very good quality. I purchased this. This is from Kerala in India. Spark plug boot. This is the condenser. It will be connected parallel to the circuit.
and this is the lock chain guides lock the, the screws will be fitted here through these holes the bolts slash screws will go to the securing point after that we will bend this from any side to avoid self unlocking of screws these two are the top cover headlight top cover securing screws brake springs it's a connector the spark plug will be fitted here like this this is the float needle this float needle and this all these small parts can be purchased separately and these are the speedometer lamps and these are the circ clips for locking brake shoes along with the plate these are various nut and bolts for securing wheel and wheel rims etc and in this also and these are is the same one these also comes in spare so you can find in automobile shop earlier i said there is a difference between this point and this point this point and this point see there is no there are no further parts here in this whereas you can find some parts along with this i will show you see it is secured fully it is full unit whereas it is not a full unit see it is secured if you want to change the point just open this one and connect the wire it is having very good temperament contact point there should not be any grounding and it is little bit tricky we have to be patient while setting up the timing with this